I'm not sure it's wonderful host, but at least she's the wonderful one here, right? So <laughs> thank you. Uh, so everyone are still, you know, not not falling asleep after a heavy lunch this afternoon. But we have some exciting sessions planned for the day, and we'll be exciting some wonderful speakers. So before I jump into the agenda, let me ask a question. So every year we'll be having, you know, a lot of speakers traveling from different parts of the world. To, uh, to Singapore to attend Force Asia Summit. So I would like to know who travelled the farthest. Maybe start with 10, 10 hours. <laughs> who flew in 10 hours flight time? Oh, oh a lot. 11 hours. Yeah. 12 hours. 13, 14, 15, 16, <laughs> 17. Oh my goodness, 18. <laughs> uh, 18, did I see 18? 17, oh, 18. And they are 19, 20, 20, 21, 21, 22. Which planet were you from? <laughs> we only got 24 hours. <laughs> all right, excellent. So thank you very much for coming all the way. Thank you very much. Cheers. Who arrived here from the MRT station? All of us put up our hands. <laughs> right, okay, excellent. So, well, so welcome to Force Asia. We have a lot of stuff that's planned for you over the next three days. Uh, we have, as you can see, 12 tracks. That's a lot of tracks. We have over 200 plus speakers. Uh, 250 plus sessions. And you can see the various topics. Every single topic in here happens because we are dealing with open source software every single component here. Isn't that amazing? And just to think that 20 years ago, we did not have the words open source. Why? It was 20 years ago that finally we figured out that how are we going to market this thing called free software. And the Open Source Inc. was incorporated uh, in, 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 in uh, February of two, uh, 1998. So to this year marks the 20th anniversary of opensource.org. So who's here from opensource.org? Oh, there you go. Please stand up and please be recognized. So thank you very much for leading the charge in open source. It is all about collaboration. It's all about sharing good information, good code, and having a lot of fun in the process. So. We are very thankful that we have an opportunity to do events like this, FOSS Asia in Singapore. This is the how many event that we have? This is how many years already? Eight years? Eight, nine, nine years. I can't have to count your fingers. <laughs> so this is the ninth edition of FOSS Asia. And I think this is going to be phenomenal because all the topics that we have are lined up and the speakers. But I think what's more interesting is the future that holds from here. What we look forward to is for next year's 10th anniversary. Hopefully, we'll have an even bigger and more uh, interesting event uh, uh, planned. But in the meantime, we have a bunch of things that we're going to do to, uh, in, over the next three days. Um, we have uh, Code Heat Awards. This is to recognize people who have contributed and participated in coding activities and a competition. Uh, we will hear a little bit more uh, slightly later. Um, we also have uh, Open Source Inc. Uh, sponsoring 200 free nights to stay in Singapore for participants who are coming from outside Singapore so that they can participate in Force Asia. And I think I would like to thank uh, Open Source Inc. for being the wonderful sponsor of that uh, opportunity. And the final thing in this slide is the hackathon that we're going to hold uh, that is being organized by UNESCO and Force Asia. And that is happening tomorrow on Saturday. So I uh, look forward to seeing you guys participating in that and I think that's going to be useful. A lot of ideas, a lot of ways to solve our world problems. So with that, let me just uh, round up and mention what's happening downstairs. Upstairs is where we are here right now. Downstairs is uh, where we have a exhibition hall. I think some of you are not seeing it. Okay. As you can see, the grey boxes, that's where the exhibition is being held. Uh, please visit the exhibition hall and talk to the exhibitors because clearly there's a lot of uh, information that you can share and get gain from them. But I think and I hope they have a lot of stickers, a lot of swag. So those of you who have got laptops, can I see how many of you have laptops open right now? 
Can I look at the back of your laptops? If those laptops, oh, that is too empty. Oh, that is way too empty. You need some more stickers on your laptops. So please go downstairs, get whatever sticker. Oh, okay, that's a good sticker, yes. Oh, you need more stickers on that as well. So please fill up your laptop. You should make your laptop look like this. Just let me get my laptop here. Uh, where's my bag now? Oh, uh, Michael, you can show your laptop. No, uh, uh, mine is over there. Can you just, I, I just want to show you how you can make your laptop look seasoned and well-traveled. No, that's not good enough. Ah, there you go. All right. Make sure your laptop has got multiple layers of stickers. All right. It's very important to do that. So at least you have shown that you do stuff. Stickers is good enough, right? It sticks to you. All right. So please make sure you visit that. And make sure you carry a bag full of swag so that the organizers need not carry them back home. Exactly. It's they don't want to bring the stickers back home, please. You bring it back. And now, Harish, you listen. forgot to mention about your favorite track. Oh, yes. That's right. <laughs> If you look here, there is one very important track that is missing. My favorite track, called the hallway track. So as you go out, you bump into somebody, have a chat, introduce yourself, say who you are, what it is that you do, why are you here, what kind of world problems you're trying to solve. So get to know them, that's an excellent way to network, to meet people and understand what's, what's going on and in the minds of different people that you're going to meet over the next three days. So, Hallway track is never mentioned, but it's the most important track. Okay, of all these tracks, that's to me the most important track. With that, let's look at. So I'll take this moment to thank all the sponsors for this uh, for making this event a grand success. I'm, I'm sure it will be a grand success. So firstly, Lifelong Learning Institute, uh, which is a training campus under Skills Future Singapore. Thank you so much for co-organizing for Asia. Please get a round of applause. And we have two diamond sponsors this year, Daimler and Google Cloud. Thank you so much. And our gold sponsor, Indeed. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> yes. Come on guys, more enthusiasm for sponsors, very important people. Yeah. Our premium sponsor, Microsoft. Silver sponsor, JP Morgan. Our hackathon partner UNESCO and Open Tech Night sponsor OSI. We are also supported and partnered by a bunch of organizations. Um, so thank you so much. Singapore Science Center, SPH Digital, Gandhi.net, Platform.sh, MySQL, Mothership, Impact Hub by Singapore, SUSI, CentOS, FreeBST, Ask Me and Asia Finance. Thank you so much guys for making this event happen. All right, so that brings us to the start of our afternoon proceedings. So we are delighted to have with us, to have our opening keynote, uh, a member of parliament in Singapore, Mr. Teo uh, Sir Lak, who will be speaking to us about how open source, open technology and collaboration can help drive the economy that we have here forward as well as economies around the world. So, Mr. Teo, the stage is all yours.